Hey everybody, this is Dr. Adair, your number one Amazon best-selling author of 13 books and three curricula. I hope you guys are feeling okay today, but I have a sense that some of you are not. Some of you are feeling burdened. Some of you are feeling challenged, maybe not physically well, mentally well, emotionally um, well, none of that. Some of you are not feeling feeling it today. And so I wanted to reach out to you today with a word of encouragement to let you know that yes, life is hard now. Life is tough. It may have been hard for a long time, but I don't want you to give up yet. I want you to just keep holding on because I strongly believe that God hears you. Um, God has a plan for you. And though you may not recognize and understand it now, it's there. I'm going to need you to hold on, keep holding on to your faith. Even if your faith feels like it's the size of a mustard seed, know that it's strong enough to move the mountains out of your way. Know that God has created a path that's just for you and it will be revealed just to you. So I know it's rough. I've been there. I've done that. God knows I was going through stuff for a couple of years kept holding on kept holding on and some days i'd wake up and say god why me or how come i'm trying to be your child doing the right thing making the right choices and decisions but nothing seemed to go my way it just seemed to be like can it get any worse and just when i thought it couldn't get any worse it got a bit worse but through it all i still held on to that nugget to that mustard seed saying that okay if i keep leaning on my triple shields of grace faith and mercy this too shall pass it took a long time but i never ever ever stopped believing did i question him did i say what the what you know on some mornings and some days saying how much absolutely but never giving up, just holding on, knowing that my prayers were going to be answered. Little did I know that God was answering my prayers all along. It just didn't feel like it was revealed to me. So as you're going through this tough season in your life, just don't really give up. Just keep plugging away, knowing that you may get signs of improvement bit by bit, but also know that every drop eventually fills a bucket. Know that just because you may fall down, that doesn't mean you're a part of the dirt. And I've learned that the best part of hitting rock bottom is that there really is no place else to go but up. Knowing that you may be bent, but you're not broken. You may be damaged, but you're not destroyed. Knowing that he has already equipped and empowered you, those thoughts, that power of positive thinking is what can help put you, help you to put one foot in front of the other every day. And I get it. Everybody's pain is different. Everybody's challenge is different. But one thing that I do know remains the same among all of us is God's love for us. So as you're going through whatever you're going through today, I really just want you to hold on. Oh, I feel like I spit. I want you to hold on and trust and believe. Trust in that process. Know that God's got you. Know that you got this. Know that there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Know that there's a path that was created just for you, a road that was created just for you, that he's preparing you to walk on. And God knows what's best. God knows what's right. And just feel uplifted. Lean on those triple shields. Just feel empowered that the best is yet to come. I believe it. I truly believe it, regardless of whatever you've gone through, because my journey has revealed to me that if I can get through it and still come up standing, then I know you can get through it too. But you just have to tr tr you just have to trust and believe and know that there's some work you have to do. You can't put it all on God to take care of it all. When he gives you a sign, when he tells you what to do, take a moment and listen. It makes the biggest difference. So I'm not sure who needed to hear this, but he put it on my heart, my spirit, in my mind, and out my mouth to share it with you today. So I'm sharing it with you today. You got this. Everything is going to be all right. Trust the process. Trust the process and trust God. Have a good one.